Thanks again for joining us here at Kalkine TV and this is what's happening in the news around the world today. Bloomberg News has today reported that China has ordered central government agencies and state-backed corporations to replace foreign branded personal computers with domestic alternatives within two years, making one of Beijing's most aggressive efforts so far to eradicate key overseas technology from within its most sensitive organs. Staff were allegedly asked after the week-long May break to turn in foreign PCs for homemade alternatives that run on operating software developed domestically, inside sources familiar with the plan said. The exercise, which was mandated by central government authorities, is likely to eventually replace at least 50 million PCs on a central government level alone, they said, asking to remain anonymous, discussing a sensitive matter. The decision advances China's decade-long campaign to replace imported technology with local alternatives, a sweeping effort that covers everything from semiconductors to networking gear and phones. It's likely to directly affect sales by HP Inc and Dell Technologies Inc, the country's biggest PC brands after local champion Lenovo Group Limited. The replacement effort reflects Beijing's growing concerns around information security as well as a confidence in homegrown hardware. The world's biggest laptop and server makers today include Lenovo, Huawei Technologies Co and Inspur Limited, while local developers such as Kingsoft and Standard Software have made rapid strides in office software against the likes of Microsoft Corp and Adobe Inc. The campaign will be extended to provincial governments later and also abide by the two-year time frame, according to the source from Bloomberg. China has been encouraging use of homemade IT products in government agencies for at least a decade, regularly barring certain products from government procurement lists. In response, US IT giants such as Hewlett Packard Enterprise Co and Microsoft have set up joint ventures with firms backed by the Chinese government to secure orders from the richest state-owned companies. The latest central government directive is likely to cover only PC brands and software and exclude hard to replace components such as processors from Intel and AMD, according to the source. Certain agencies, including state-owned media and cyber security bodies, may continue to buy advanced foreign equipment under special permits, as they always have, one of the people from Bloomberg has said. That permit system could be tightened in future, according to the sources quoted today in Bloomberg News. And that's the latest here at Kalkine TV. Stay tuned. Plenty more updates coming your way right throughout the afternoon. I'm Rose Jacobs. Thanks for joining me.